per the New York Pro Wrestling Commission, uh, Ghost Shadow has suffered an elbow injury, and, and, and Carter Mason is now the Catalyst Wrestling Freestyle Champion. That, that, is, that is what we are being told. After that title run, after that title run, everything that's gone through, what just happened? How could you live with yourself? How could you possibly do this kind of thing? Listen, all jokes aside, I know you are supposed to be a human being here, and you pretend to be a New Yorker when I was born. <laughs> How's that for being New York, bitch? Q, oh. the thing about all your main events is they seem to have homicide in all of them. So, if I were you, uh, and, and by the way, nice mustache, I know you're trying to get on Darius Carter's level, and you do not look as good as me, and you never will. And the only reason that you were picked to be signed before me is because of your daddy. You who, T? You wanna know? This is the New York Giant. This is the Empire State Building, baby. He's very tall. He's very tall. You know what else he is? He's a real New Yorker, just like me. Darius Carter, champion. Biggest crowds we've ever seen here in Catalyst Wrestling. Pandemic or not, I don't know, was everybody sick? <laughs> Who knows? I think you're re rewriting history for sure. Rewriting history? What am I, a scab? Yo, yo, what's wrong, what's up? Car trouble? But you're good, though. You're making it, right? All right, bet, bet. Cool, cool. No, no. Yo, ho oh, Jay, what's good, baby? Uh-huh. <laughs> Alright. Say less. I got you. One. He's cheating is what he's doing. Potato, potato. I guess we'll have to change. The we just see things a little differently. Oh, and right to the digits. Ooh. Attacking that face, using those boots to rub his face raw. You gotta love that old school style. Don't go into this well of tricks that you don't see as often. Darius Carter pulls things out. You can tell he watches game tape constantly. Darius Carter is one of the most studious professional wrestlers putting, in his words, the pro back in professional wrestling. He's wrenching the neck. I mean, just like a spinning toehold to the neck. When is the last time you saw something like this? The NWA, back in the 70s? These were effective moves that won world championships. Trying to get back on pace to win a championship here is Carter. But putting some stank on it is North Carolina's favorite son. You don't want to stand toe to toe as we see a drop toe hold, almost as if on cue. Darius Carter realized the position he was putting himself in and rectified it. There you go. And this now is where Carino's Darius is in trouble. This is where Darius is the most dangerous. When he starts working on, when he starts to isolate a body part and just starts working on it, this is where he becomes the most dangerous man in Catalyst Wrestling. But again, taking too much time to posture and preen. I don't know, for, for once I have to question the strategy of Darius Carter here. That's true, it's a rare lapse in judgment for Darius Carter, but at the same time, he needs to let these people know who they came to see, and it's him, not Kobe Carino. Where has Kobe Carino been? Darius Carter's... Ooh. Oh, with the kitchen sink. And Carino heads to the outside, trying to catch a breather. But in this hot weather outside here in Chilos, every time you try and take that, that deep breath. What is this referee doing? Trying to allow Colby to get back into the ring. I suppose. And Ron Starr capitalizing on the outside, attempting to take out Carino. But Carino wise to that as we see the muscle, the muscling up Carter. Suplex, one, two. Back to the face, tearing piece by piece. Went for, to the mouth, went to the nose, went to the eyes, and now the ear. To be fair, Kobe. Has his finger inside of the gauged ears, yanking on it. You gotta wonder what 
possesses a competitor to put something like that in their ear. It's just a target. That's a great word, though, possessed, because that's what it seems like Darius Carter is to get back to the top of the mountain here. But Carino is Ooh. not going to let that happen. Second Mongolian chop there. And now right back to the ear. I mean, this is almost just a dehumanizing. A lot of this is about sending a message, a message of pain for sure. Twisting his finger. He's going to tear his lobe clean off. To be fair, there's nothing wrong with what he's doing. Oh, and he ripped out the, the earring. Did he rip it out? He pulled it right out, ripped it out of the ear. Disgusting. Kobe's lucky to still have an ear at this moment. Carino in trouble in his return here to Catalyst. And now clamping on those forearms on the jaw, but look at the wrists obstructing his breathing there. That's the thing, Darius has that lanky body. He can really get into any sort of crevice that you leave open, really grab a hook and hold you down, really wear you down, take the breath from you. The great shooters and stretchers of our time. And Carter sent outside by Carino, who gets a brief reprieve here. Ron Stark catching him on the outside. That's why it's important to have a friend with you, a cornerman. No friends needed when gravity's your friend. Come on, Colby! Oh. And flying senton takes out Carter, but you see the wear and tear. And Carino trying to will himself back into this matchup. More action after this. Are you tired of just drinking in bars, loud? noisy, then sign up with us, Bar Rover. With Bar Rover, we can bring the bar to you. Specialized whiskey tastings, designed to give you exactly what you're looking for, to learn about the spirits that you already love to drink. Let's bring the bar to you. like this when you're scrolling your social media feed, looking for something to engage you, entice you, and possibly be violent. Well, we have a solution. Follow Catalyst Wrestling on Instagram. Great photos, great highlights, and ways to find out how you can join us live in New York City. Join Catalyst Wrestling, make your feed more fun, and at least 50% more violent. Back with the action here, Ducks underneath, big Ooh. chops to the chest, and now here he comes. The chest reddened by those blows, and now set up. The San Diego influence there. Buyaka indeed. Up to the top, big elbow, cover, one, two, in his return, can't put Carter away. And Carino can't believe it. I think he might be the only one that can't believe it. Look, here's the thing, what are you doing? Stay on him. This is well, Darius this, Carter. Well, this is where the championship pedigree of both men pays off. As you get into these later moments of the match, you see Carino and Carter getting better and better. The more exhausted they are, as you see, locking on that million dollar dream. It's an interesting thing. We do a lot of talking about gas tank as we call these matches. 
and there's nobody with better gas tank that's been in more championship matches than these two men. Those matches have longer time limits, they go the distance, and they are difficult matches to win with Against top the contenders. Top contenders, and now they are back in that pool of top contenders. A victory here would no doubt skyrocket one of these men back towards the top where both of them feel they belong. I mean, rightfully, they both do belong. They're just... Oh, opinion, roll through, wait! Whoop. He's got him. One, two. Use that second rope to roll over. So Carter's pin, Carter's shoulders were pinned to the mat, but now transitioning back, not letting go of that rear naked choke. Colby is fading fast. Trying to will himself up. He's got to his feet, and oh. Carter could be in trouble. Oh! Ooh. Dumping him on that stack of dimes. He calls a neck. Might have just been instinct there. Kobe might be worn out. It's going to be a struggle for both of these men to get back to their feet at this point in the match. Survival, survival, survival is the name of the game right now. More action after this. look like this when you're scrolling your social media feed, looking for something to engage you, entice you, and possibly be violent. Well, we have a solution. Follow Catalyst Wrestling on Instagram. Great photos, great highlights, and ways to find out how you can join us live in New York City. Join Catalyst Wrestling, make your feed more fun, and at least 50% more violent. With Bar Rover, we can bring the bar to you. Specialized whiskey tastings, designed to give you exactly what you're looking for, to learn about the spirits that you already love to drink. Let's bring the bar to you. Neither man stirring just yet. Back with the action here. This is Carino the first to be coherent, surprisingly. It's a fulcrum point in the match. The first man to get up, the first man to launch a piece of offense right after this. That could change the entire match going forward. Both men up. Carter with a big forearm and returned. They're exchanging receipts. And for the Lariat, European uppercut. As stiff as they come. But Carino likes it. Some say Carino a glutton for punishment, but the more he takes damage, the better he seems to get. The switch was flipped, and Carter tried to turn out his lights. These men know each other a lot, and they have a receipt for everything. Oh, and just Ooh. caught him out the sky with that big Yakuza kick. And just barely was Carino able to kick out there. We almost had a winner. And those are the types of things that we saw Darius Carter during his title reign taking out Josh Woods, J.D. Drake, Anthony Green, Alex Shelley, all these people he alluded to that he has beaten and dismissed from Catalyst Wrestling. He thinks he can do the same here with Colby Carino. I don't think that that's going to happen. I mean, as of right now, Darius seems to be in the more dominant position. We'll see how it goes going forward, but Kobe seems like he might not have much left in the tank. Well, you got to figure he's been through so many emotions here. You know, the, the actions of TIM with the business now self-made, the, the, the being gone now coming back, the emotion of the moment here. Will he rise to the occasion as he's been known to do? More action. After this.
coming up. Middle rope. Double stomp to the back of the neck, and Tim is out. Cover, is it over? One, two. Back with the action here. But I don't see it. Darius Carter does not care what anybody thinks. And as you can see right oh, here, no. he might be looking to end this. And for the pile driver, couldn't get it. And for the back body drop, rolled through was Carter. Both men, oh! Caught with the knee. Very quick by Kobe. Oh! Dropping him across the knee. Just barely. Oh, and Julius Smokes heading out he has, to wet down. He has nothing to do with this thing. Oh, but who is that? Who is that? Who, oh, and now laying out the referee. I like this guy. Oh, and this match is over. Oh, come on. Deshaun Pratt. And Deshaun now working over. Colby Carino, and was this the master plan of Darius Carter? Oh, and all hell is broken loose on the outside. Like I said earlier, all Darius Carter has to do is make sure Colby Carino never comes back again. There's a commotion on the outside. Look at all these, every, the entire locker room is emptied out. Locker room is clearing. White Mike is out here. Is that Rob Killjoy at the side of the ring? Rob Killjoy is out here. The entire locker room is empty. I see our chief agent, Lee Malden. Allison Danger out at the ring. Oh, there's no stopping this. Get to the back! Get to the back! Get to the back! As everybody now in the ring, the ugly sucklings. Gosh, I hope nobody throws a beer bottle in the ring. Need security out here, there's nothing. Where, where Colby is Colby Carino security? and his students have battled back. This has become unglued. We gotta get this under control somehow, as now. Boom Harden left alone here, and now he's gonna get worked over. Here's the thing, the vacuum that and now standing tall. Oh. And we see Dallas in danger and, De and, and Darius Carter facing off. Oh, went to kick Alice in danger. Come on. That's our management here. To the back. To the damn back. Oh, and he got a hold of her hair. And now Carino. Oh my God. Sticking up for family. Carino and Carter still going at it. These two men hate each other. This has become more personal. Go, get back or you're gone. Go, go. Hopefully, we'll get control of this situation. Looks like the war between Kobe Carino, who, mind you, has no friends, no love lost here. Tri-State Saints coming over by our booth now. Oh, Tim running back in. Oh, and this is still going. This is back underway. Brandon Sokler. Here to oh, oh, Julius Smokes taken out. Our entrance ramp is being destroyed. We are out of time. We got to go. And this is far from over.
you sign up for tickets for our next show, you get a free sticker. You don't have to go home. You should stay here. I know. Stay tonight. I know. We're going to try to get this under control, and we'll see you in September. Thank you. We are Dallas Wrestling.